Ghost stories, duh! can have a quick little spooky session with you guys. Finally got some of our fall stuff out. These are cute little fall pillows. A couple little cuties here and there. I love Halloween. Our whole house will be decked out. It'll be amazing. Okay. Run down. Lighthouse place, okay? There's so much traffic that I can't really get a good, like, everybody keeps honking at me. I'm wondering if there's like a little place back here. Spooky, spookiness. They came out with Susan's own CBD full spectrum gummies. Their new item by Blazy Susan is their new CBD bath bomb. I'm gonna go right home and try this. It smelled like pure heaven. Rose bath bomb has 100 milligrams of CBD in it. I cannot wait to try this. First moved into my very first apartment. And it was a big, beautiful house. It was three stories. The building and the foundation and how old the house was that it was gonna have some kind of activity. It's home by myself going on or something was, there was an energy, right? Uh, a darkness. I wasn't sure how to navigate it at the time. So my first initial feeling was fear. I didn't know what it was like that I was feeling when I was getting that vibe from. Broken by a very loud clatter. The only way I can describe it is it was a clatter going on in my kitchen. I go into the kitchen, I rush into the kitchen and there's nothing going on. Nothing. No. Remember from my last video, me hearing things in the middle of the night? I go back to sleep. A couple days goes by and it happens again, same time. It's like 5.30, 6 o'clock in the morning at dawn. So I jump up out of bed and I run to the kitchen. I'm sure that someone is in my kitchen. Nothing. It sounded like somebody was cooking in the kitchen. Really, really weird. Paranormal activity, a movie with my then boyfriend and his best friend. I don't need to explain it to you. I know that they're real. No, they're not. No, they're not. He's arguing with me. Bullshit. Ha ha ha. Like in your face. His friend's an asshole. My light in my bedroom was on, right? And it turns off. And we see it from the corner of our eye and our, our gaze shifted over to my bedroom. Like, well, that was weird timing. The light bulb went out. It's back on. So he goes in and he fiddles with the light, messing with the light bulb, skeptic. Okay, it went out. It was meant to go out. Changes the light bulb. We go in the living room. On this time, not off. On. And the light switch was off and the light bulb was brand new. No possible way to explain this. An entity that had been there for a long time, they knew that that was their home. It had always been their home. They established it as their home, and then there were people coming in and trying to change things, mock the dishes, walking up and down the hall. I used to feel like when I walked down the, when I walked down the hall, this road is insane. It was a residual energy there, I think, for sure. Okay, start with one gummy and go from there. You thank Lazy Susan. Amazing, fantastic team. You can really tell that they put a lot of thought into every little thing they do. Give back to the community and... What isn't there good to say about Blazy Susan? Especially those pink cones. They are my ultimate, ultimate favorite rolling paper there is, period, ever. <laughs> People are crazy out here in the country. I'm crazy driving. You go to the country. All right, guys. I think this is going to be the outro of my video. Drop your spooky stories below. And yeah, I will see you guys next time. And until then, stay spooky. Internet, and I am back again. Time. 
Do share some. If you enjoyed this video, please remember to subscribe to my channel. And I just want to say thank you for stopping by.